I'm Sash and today's vlog is all about going deeper, learning more and doing more for our oceans. What is the ocean to you? Is it a giant swimming pool, perfect for cooling off on a hot day? For most of the world's biodiversity, it is a home. A home for the largest animal to have ever lived on our planet. Starfish, whose tiny water-filled feet leave microscopic footprints in the sand. Animals with teeth. No, not those. Tiny, inspiring, microscopic skin teeth that cut through water and that have inspired super fast swimsuits and paint for hospital rooms that germs do not want to stick to. Shrimp that accelerate their claws faster than gravity. Fish that leap and grab their food faster than you can blink. Animals that make sounds like this. And ancient, intricate civilizations built by colonies of tiny animals that turn water into rock. Yep, rock. Ecosystem engineers that glow in the dark, share food and send messages to each other that select and modify the shape that they grow in, that make friends, eat neighbours, can tell the time of the year, and that have a mouth, which is also their bottom. Animals that construct one of the most diverse places on earth, home to a quarter of all marine life, and home to an example of nearly every type of life on earth. The ocean provides the food that we eat, the water that we drink, and the air that we breathe. Yet, we're destroying it. We are doing irreparable damage to something that sustains us. One in three shark species are threatened with extinction. 90% of big fish populations are depleted and 50% of coral reefs are destroyed. Plus our oceans are infested with plastic. Huge floating garbage patches have formed in every ocean. Nearly all of this plastic contains something toxic. And in some areas, there is more than twice as much plastic as marine life. So it's time to take action for our ocean. Let's do something about this. There are so many little things that we can do every day that will add up to make a big difference for our oceans. Can you do the five for the five? Five simple actions for our five oceans. Walk, find just one place you can walk. Walking to school, the shops or a friend's house will reduce fossil fuel emissions and combat climate change. This will keep global temperatures down and help our reefs survive. Fight the plastic plague. Meet Dusty, one of the rescue turtles here at Aqua. We have cared for hundreds of turtles and each one has either eaten or been tangled in plastic. If you stop buying plastic, then you'll stop it ending up in the ocean and stop the harm it does to marine life. Start with your lunchbox. Is there plastic in there? Could you wrap it differently? Is there a different brand of snacks available? Ones that don't come covered in plastic? Be water wise. Wastewater and runoff carries chemicals into the ocean. The less water you use, the less potentially dangerous wastewater that will return to the ocean. Look for the tick. Seafood is the main source of protein for more than a billion people around the world. When we buy our seafood, it is important that we buy it from a company that doesn't overfish. Overfishing is when we take more than can grow back. Be an ocean ambassador. Learn something new about the ocean and most importantly, share that with someone else. Together we can be a voice for the ocean. The ocean is important. Let's look after it and join us celebrating the ocean and all its amazing features this Ocean Day.